In this video, we're going to listen to some common recording scenarios with the Zoom H5. First, we'll hear the camera's internal microphone as a baseline. Then we'll compare it to the H5 with a lavalier mic plugged in, the H5 mounted on a table close to the speaker, and the H5 mounted on the camera about 8 to 10 feet away from the speaker. If you'd like to follow along with these examples blind so you can get an honest sense of whether it makes an improvement for you, you can go ahead and minimize this window. I won't give you any spoilers as to what you're hearing in the audio, but you'll be able to tell what I'm using in the video. All right, let's get started, and I'll be back with some conclusions at the end. Good luck. 7723. About 40 years ago, I was taking a long trip on foot over mountain heights, quite unknown to tourists. In that region, in that ancient region where the Alps thrust down into Provence. All, all this at the time I embarked upon my long walk through these deserted regions was barren and colorless land. Nothing grew there but wild lavender. 2863. During his lifetime, Jean Giano, who considered himself to be Italian and provincial, in addition to French, was judged one of the greatest writers of our age by such authorities as Henri Pierre and André Malraux. Both Pierre and Malraux ranked Giono first or second in French 20th century literature. 7845. In 1935, a whole delegation came from the government to examine the natural forest. There was a high official from the Forest Service, a deputy, technicians, there was a great deal of ineffectual talk. It was decided that something must be done, and fortunately, nothing was done except the only helpful thing. The whole forest was placed under the protection of the state, and charcoal burning was prohibited. 8925. The oaks of 1910 were then 10 years old and taller than either of us. It was an impressive spectacle. I was literally speechless, and as he did not talk, we spent the whole day walking in silence through his forest. In three sections, it measured 11 kilometers in length and three kilometers at its greatest width. When you remembered that all this had sprung from the hands and soul of just one man, you understood that men could be as effectual as God in other realms than that of destruction. So as you can probably hear, the Zoom H5 is a big improvement in audio quality over your camera's internal microphone. You're going to get the best performance using a lavalier mic or when you mount the H5 closer to your speaker on a tabletop tripod. You probably could even hear that it's a bit better mounted on the camera, even 8 to 10 feet away from your speaker, but that's not really an ideal recording scenario. So you probably noticed you heard a, a good amount of reverb and ambient noise uh, and it wasn't very focused on the speaker. So I hope you found this helpful. If you do, uh, please do follow a link from the description of this video before you make your purchase and that'll help support me. And if you're looking for a different audio comparison, you'll find many uh, different videos on my channel comparing common scenarios in the same kind of blind format. So if you wanted to get that honest assessment of is it really worth it to upgrade your audio recorder, you should be able to find the video you're looking for on my channel. All right, take care.